Have you ever wondered why your urine had certain weird colors? So in this video, I'll be telling you what that color of urine, what that abnormal color of urine has to say about your health. So please stay with me to the end of this video because you will get to know what this color says about your health and also know when to visit the hospital. Welcome back to my channel. I'm Grace and I upload videos based on my learning experiences as a medical laboratory science student and also my learning experiences in life generally. So in this particular video, I will be telling you what the abnormal color of urine, or even the normal one actually has to say about your health. So whenever you go to the hospital, you know, you go for a urine analysis, you go for a urine examination. So this urine examination, like your urine sample undergoes like three different steps. First of all, we have the macroscopic examination, which is what I'll be covering in this video. And I'll be focusing only on the color. Then we have the chemical examination, which has to do with certain reagent strips, you know, that when you dip into the urine, you get certain results. It can be an indication of a certain disease condition. Then we have the microscopic examination. So this microscopic examination means you viewing the stuff under the microscope to be able to detect certain things that can be an indication of a disease condition. So if you're new to my channel, please subscribe to my channel and then you turn on the post notification so that you get notified for when I drop new videos because I'll be dropping videos every week based on you know health related content so you don't want to miss out on any of this. So I want to let you know that the normal color of your urine is pale yellow. So if you have deviations from this normal color, let's say you have you know a urine sample or you urinate and this your urine is transparent looking like water this means that you are overhydrated. and before i forget yeah when you have a pale yellow urine you know it means that you're well hydrated you're drinking enough water but whereby you have you know a transparent urine it can mean that you are overhydrated. you are drinking water more than you expected to on a normal day, you're supposed to drink an average of 6 to 8 glasses of water. But whereby, you know, you're drinking maybe 15, you know, to 20 glasses or thereabouts, this can be a problem. You are supposed to drink water, but then moderation is key. You're not supposed to drink this water in excess because it can actually cause you water intoxication. It can be a problem to your kidneys. So you have to drink water in a moderate quantity. This can also be associated with a certain disease condition known as diabetes insipidus. So this diabetes insipidus is a problem whereby, you know, you're urinating a lot, you're excreting a lot of urine. So this is caused by malfunctioning in your kidney. So this is a cause for alarm and this happens like if you notice this on a regular basis whereby you're urinating and you're seeing this transparent coloration you have to visit the hospital and see a doctor then you can have a urine that is dark yellow so when you have this urine it just tells you that you're not drinking enough water you are dehydrated probably you're doing so much exercise or you're not drinking enough water as you're supposed to drink so this means that you know you need to be drinking water to stay hydrated do you get that kind of thing so yep that is something else so we can also have a urine that is orange in color so this would be an indication of a urinary tract infection it can be an indication of a liver problem it can be an indication of a problem in your bowel duct you know especially when you see your stool having this you know light brown color so this can tell you let's say when you have this and you also have your urine looking orange it can tell you that yeah you have a problem in your bowel duct you can have your urine looking yellowish brown in color so this would indicate the presence of bilirubin this bilirubin it is a substance that is cutting from the breakdown of red blood cells. You know, red blood cells, they have a lifespan of 120 days. Every 120 days, you know, they die off, new ones are produced. So when these red blood cells break down, this bilirubin, it is cutting as a degradation of these blood cells. 
so this can be an indication of jaundice so you have to visit the hospital and you can have your urine like looking you know milkish white in color so this is associated with a disease condition known as chyluria so this chyluria it is caused by a parasite it is a parasitic infection and this is as a result of lymphatic fluid leaking into your kidney when they leak into your kidney you know your kidneys that are supposed to produce normal urine your kidney starts to produce a urine that is milkish white in color this is a cause for alarm and you should visit your hospital as soon as possible so you can also have a urine that is dark brown in color so this can be an indication of a urinary tract infection it can be an indication of a kidney problem it can be an indication of a liver problem it can also be caused by a food substance you know there is this food called fava beans and when you eat it it can cause your urine to turn to this dark brown coloration so yeah if you notice any of this you still have to go and visit the hospital to check if it's a disease condition or if it's from your dietary intake so we can also have certain colors you know you can have the red color we can have the blue color we can have even pink it can be caused by you know some medications that we take on a normal day it can be caused by certain substances that contains dye because by some fruits you eat and even some vegetables like we have the beetroot and we have the blueberries so these things you know this particular fruit i just mentioned it causes your urine to have a reddish coloration and you can also have a vegetable called rhubarb this rhubarb it causes your urine to have a pinkish coloration and then when you see your urine you know looking blue in color this can be an indication of a disease condition known as the blue diaper syndrome so it usually happens in children but if you see it as an adult it's also a cause for alarm so you have to visit the hospital so all in all i've been able to cover the macroscopic examination of your urine basically focusing on the color i'll be uploading another video telling you what's the appearance of your urine you know what it has to say about your health so please you know if you haven't subscribed to my channel please subscribe to my channel you turn on your post notifications so that when i drop it you know you go on and you watch this video and you get enlightened so that you know what these things mean and you know when to see a doctor i would also add that this is not a complete diagnosis like i said this is only just the macroscopic examination of your urine it has to still undergo the chemical process and the microscopic examination before they come to a total diagnosis even you don't even have to go for other tests you know before they tell you like yeah this is what is doing you if you enjoyed this video please like my video and you subscribe to my channel and please share this video to as many people as you can so they also get enlightened with you and please turn on the post notification so that you get notified when i drop new videos i'll see you guys in my next video